The true yogi is one who realizes that he or she herself or herself is the actual conduit for the breath itself. So your body is doing the yoga, but what is happening is your body is putting yourself in a position to breathe out and to expand what the breath is because you're using muscles and certain things that you, nobody else uses. So to take that away from you and to make you think that it's a strictly Hindu practice or whatever, they've created a mass market to dilute the aspect of it to make you doubt the fact that you can generate your own heat to do that. You don't need to go to nobody else to do that. Your yoga is not predicated or that what you want to do is not predicated on this reality giving you the permission to do so. You have given the reality the permission to influence you. Therefore, our biggest issue or one of our two of the biggest issues I find our people dealing with is apathy, laziness, and self-doubt. So if you can understand, uh, if you can understand that these things are all physical manifestations that don't exist anywhere else but here. <laughs> You can rise above whatever preconceived notion it is. If you want to be a yogi, be the yogi. And don't predicate it on what anybody else's yoga is. Learn the system and then put yourself...